Miami Dome with Ken Patron, who owns and who owns this for us. I've been very excited about the album. We've been having a little bit of the last time now. It's the Garage of Lana, the other song we got for Justin. I'm not sure why there's not there. The French line, but Bob did a very nice bit. Output. 
not the main input. Now the input. R value is 1k. Parametrics will be 1000k. 100 mega m. This is the value of V out. Now we want to add a plot to the window x axis. The value of I load. So on the display, we have I load and V load output. That's the value of Z output, output impedance. Now change the sweep values. Now we're gonna give the find the combo mode rejection ratio. Now slew that can be found by input pulse. So now we are giving square waves. These are all, all the graphs we're gonna plot and in detail at the end. These are all the values. 50 microvolt. Added the properties. 50 volt AC supply. So this we give uh, the frequency response as fluid. So we can make all these changes we are doing to find all this quantity. Added the simulation. So it's a V output divided by V input. So this is V the gain we're gonna find. We're gonna find the parameter. That's the parameter you got it. <laughs> this is on the graph we plotting. the on time and off time so this is the v output one v output two v output one This will give you. Now we're gonna create another blank project and we're gonna add LM3 to 4. Now, in the other page, we paste the same circuit. Now, this is the 3 to 4.
put in the output too. Now see, change the parameters and value from the simulations. Now we can see the effect. That's the output. Now we have to find a frame. This is the value of the V output at the end. V input 2. This is the value of the game. This could be the value of 10k. Now we're gonna make a signal to noise at a very low frequency. So this is all the values. We determine the signal to noise ratio at a very low frequency, like of 1k, 1 kilohertz. Decrease too much. That's all we got it. 